Hi there, today we're talking about two different things. Firstly, the elephant in the room and what's coming. Plus, I'd like to just mention that we've had another nine candidates arrive from the Philippines yesterday. And that's a very exciting time for us because we get to transform another nine Filipino lives, as well as the lives of the client where the candidates are going into because they get to have another nine people arrive in their workshop and do their work. But not for another two weeks, of course, because they are in isolation. They've got their quarantine period to go through for the next two weeks, but it's a very exciting time at TPRC. My name's Greg Holmeson, and the big topic for today is the elephant in the room. Now, I know it is starting to be spoken of, but I don't think we have scratched the surface on the challenge that we are all going to have across trades and many, many different areas of recruitment because of what's coming. We haven't had uh, as many inquiries ever as what we've had in the past two weeks for our services. And we still haven't uh, completely got moving on the hundreds of billions of dollars of infrastructure projects that are going to go ahead throughout the country. So the government, state governments, federal governments have all announced infrastructure projects that are going ahead and we are only just starting to see that happen now. So I believe we are going to have a real challenge. And remember, it takes six months to get someone in from the Philippines or from anywhere for that matter. When we have the, we've got our own internal assessment, we've got a trade skills assessment that we do, plus there's the Cert 3 um, or the TRA that the candidates need to sit prior to lodging a visa. So the process, although we've had people in three or four months, um, it can also take you know, six, seven, eight, or even nine months sometimes, depending on English requirements and what else has to be done to get the candidate on shore. So it's coming. And um, if you think you are short of people now, wait till you see what happens when we get the uh, infrastructure projects underway. So Greg Holmeson, Philippines Recruitment Company, more from me later with further updates on where we're at where we are at all things Philippines recruitment. Cheers.